I will explain how to create a completely self-made keyboard using LED. Incorporate the LED backlight into the previously created prototype keyboard type B keyboard. This method works with all Pro Micro using QMK firmware. When creating a completely self-made keyboard, the major method is to output with a 3D printer or hollow out the acrylic panel with a laser cutter. In this video, I output with a 3D printer. Required material is the currently displayed keyboard frame. Then the key switches. It is an advantage of a completely self-made keyboard that the key switch fits any key switches. Keycaps Pro Micro Heat resistant cross link vinyl insulated wire and insulated enamel wire Rectifier diode LED light diode Please refer to the blog for the detailed name of the material Disassemble the key switch and insert a cannonball shaped LED This video uses a plus or minus two legged LED Incorporate lead into the image reference Those who want to do it may be able to rubring I will make 18 pieces in this video. When viewed from the back side, place the long legged plus on the left and the right on the minus. Apply the 18 piece key switch with lead created earlier to the yellow part referring to the image. In this video, I put the LED in the 18 piece key switch, but it takes time, but it is okay to put the lead in all the key switches. Now, put the key switch on the key frame output by the 3D printer. The bottom row is a low profile. The keyboard layout created this time is a grid type, which is one of the minimal and rational destinations. From here solder the rectifier diode to all key switches. Solder the rectifier diode referring to the image, this is the same pattern with LEDs installed on all. Rectifier diodes are soldered in the plus to minus directions. It may be safe to create it while checking it many times. This is a reference video of soldering. I'm using a video of a previous prototype keyboard type B but what I'm doing is the same. Then solder the red vertical line. Soldered all vertical lines. Works if the vertical and horizontal lines are insulated. Solder the purple and blue parts, insulate the purple and blue parts. The blue and purple lines are insulated, it doesn't matter if they are in contact. Solder the Pro Micro and key switches from here. Solder the numbers on the back of the Pro Micro and the numbers on the keyboard. Be sure to match the numbers on the Pro Micro with the numbers on the blueprint. To make the LED shine, connect the cable to low for plus and RX1 for minus. Cut off unnecessary legs with nippers. After soldering the cable, solder the cable and Pro Micro. Solder the cable as shown in the image. From here, set the QMK firmware on your PC. In this video, we will build the environment using Arch Linux. See URL for how to install Arch Linux. Pseudo pack Manziu. Update entire package. Pseudo pack man s git. Install git. Python 3m pip install upgrade pip. Enter the code and enter. The code is posted on the blog. CDQMK firmware. sudo.utilpinstall.sh. .utilmukeyboard.sh. PKA. Enter. Prototype. Micro keyboards pkconfig.h. Code overwrite. Code posted on blog. Micro keyboards pkapka.h. Code overwrite. Code posted on blog. Micro keyboards pkeymaps default keymap.c Code overwrite, code posted on blog. Flash to Pro Micro. Connect PC with Pro Micro and Archinax with USB cable. Sudo make pk default avergeud. When reset your controller now comes out. Short the Pro Micro ground and reset with a pinset. The device will come out with the appearance and the writing will be done. After writing, put it in the keyboard case. Fasten with screws. Put on the keycas. It was completed. Prototype keyboard, type A key map. Please refer to the link for the background of this keyboard layout. QWERTY keyboard layout is also included. The mode for only the left hand, which is easy when editing Photoshop is also described. 
You can change these key layouts by holding down the escape key and pressing each key. Also, keyboard shortcuts that correspond to the color of each key will work. If you want to enter numbers or function keys, you can press and hold X key 2 to enter magenta colored keys. In addition, half width and full width functions by clicking the ortho key. No conversion, full conversion key also works by clicking EX2, EX3. You can change the amount of light from the backlight by holding down EX2 and pressing the L and G keys. Since the bottom row has a low profile, the burden on the thumb can be greatly reduced. Test if LED is working. It worked. We sell keyboards similar to the prototype keyboard type A created this time on the site. Details of this time are described in the blog. Thank you for watching until the end. It will be very encouraging if you subscribe to our channel and treat Amazon gifts. We sell minimal keyboards on the site. Love on the peace.